Good afternoon, everybody. Full head and eye. When I tell you I had a day today, I had a day. This might turn into a rant. I need y'all to strap in because some of y'all are going to... This is going to be funny because I had to laugh about it myself. So, <laughs> you know, if, if, if you are not together, if you don't have your shit together, stop getting in relationships. Just, just, just stop it. Just stop. let me tell you something. Today has been a time, as y'all know, I'm the counselor. So I got my own stuff I'm dealing with. Okay. Then I got to come to work and counsel these people. Then I got other people calling me outside of my, of, outside of my job, outside of my profession, asking, you know what I'm saying? And all of it, all of it is based in relationships. Let me tell you something. If you don't have your shit together, and I'm not saying you got to have everything together. You don't have to have everything together because we all come with some baggage. You hear me? I'm about to get surgical with this shit. So strap in. We all come with some baggage, right? And I'm aware of that. But see, a lot of the times we be thinking, oh, you know, you come with a little reds who dads like, you know, you got the, you got the carry on baggage. You know, you just do, 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 all that shit. Hell no. Niggas is coming with the big body baggage. The one you got to check in the plane baggage. The one that says fragile on it. Heavy duty load. What the fuck? Like, if you got heavy duty loads, you need to be one with the Lord. <laughs> just get down with the Lord. <laughs> don't, don't bring other people on board for that. And that happens all the time. Be honest with yourself. And I say that because I had to say that to myself. Want to be in a relationship so bad? I'm dealing with stuff and I got to deal with they stuff. And so, I, you know what? I was, I was tired. I was tired. And a lot of the times we never say what we really want. That be the problem right there. We never fucking say what we really want. Like what we really want to do, what we really want to, what we really, what we really don't want to do because of boundaries. We lack boundaries with one another. Oh, I love you so much. So you allow a person to be a habitual line stepper consistently. I've I've stepped over lines and I've allowed other people to step over my lines. You know, get your shit together. Get your shit together. And I'm not just talking to y'all. I'm talking to me too. I like to get your shit together. Because ain't no way. Nobody wants to deal with that in real time. Like, I don't want to deal with that. If you know you got some issues, go get help. Whatever help looks like. And sometimes it's hard. You know what I mean? Like, I know, I know two doctors, like professional doctors, that their spouses have to fight and argue with them about them going to the doctor. How you going to provide a treatment you don't want to take yourself? Oh, fix it, Jesus. Be one with, him, one with the Lord. I am one with the Lord. I kid you not. I do not. I'm in a space in my life right now. Like, yes, dude, you want something all nice and cuddly and cozy. It's beautiful. God damn. It's just in-house stuff. It's just, oh, man, it's amazing. You know, it's beautiful. However, it's a lot more than it just being love and, and sex, man. It is a lot. It takes a lot more than that. You understand? It's about you respecting your own boundaries. A person respecting their own boundaries. Y'all respecting each other's boundaries. And respect is love, man. And love is respect. The two go hand in hand. If you're not, if you're not able to do that, you got too much baggage. You need to work on your shit. Get your shit together and stop being with other people. Because nobody wants to deal with that. In real time. No one. And I said what I said. Oh, excuse me. Let me know. <laughs> I said what I said. Y'all have a beautiful Friday. And remember, you don't have to. And it's okay. You can always change your mind. You don't have to. You don't have to. You don't have to. And there's nothing wrong with choosing yourself. And a lot of people, and sometimes that decision hurts. Because you want to be in a relationship. You want you, you want it. It's, it's beautiful. But if you got some stuff to work on, man, and some stuff to work through, you know what I'm saying, that's traumatizing. And don't sit here in front. Hey, if you've been cheated on nine times, you with somebody, yeah, you always, I, I always go through my phone because I'm so used to being cheated on. I, I, I don't know. I think it's going to come. I don't know. I'm nervous. And you know, it might not even be any signs and stuff like that. And that's just one example. Now that's it. I said what I said. We go all frizzy. And what the hell going on? It's hot. Fucking bugs. I had, I had a day, y'all. I had a day today. I've never... Yo. I had to see 37 patients. 37. Not counting... The four individuals in my life that call me, oh my God, girl. And I can't say it because I'll be like, oh my God, girl. You know what I'm saying? We crying to each other and stuff, you know? And now I got to go and deal with some more clients. Lord, bless me, y'all. Just pray for me. Pray for me and my family. Just pray for us. Shit, forehead in. Now, y'all can't even see the forehead. Wig is all frizzy. Sick of this shit. Tired. I'm tired today. But y'all have a great Friday. This is a real nice day. I'll be in the house working. Y'all enjoy y'all Friday. What an eye, you know.